Well, students at Citronelle High School were in for a treat this morning. The school hosting an Opportunities Day featuring live entertainment and a career fair. Fox News reporter Stephen Moody has more on the resources that are available to students. Wednesday was Opportunities Day at Citronelle High School. The event put on by local DJs Dirty Dan and DJ Rotsky gives students a chance to talk with people about careers and or specific needs and resources available in the community. Citronelle isn't the first school to experience this. Williamson High School had the same opportunity earlier this school year. There were representatives from organizations that focus on continuing education, mental health awareness, violence prevention, financial literacy, and so much more. There's so many different organizations in here that, that represent so many different uh, walks of life, genres, and career opportunities. We just want to make sure we put them in front of the kids because we need, we need our future leaders. We need our future leaders. Yeah. And one of those organizations was the Mobile County Health Department. We have a lot of different MCHD departments out here from WIC, COVID-19, STI, Family Health. So we're just um, happy and proud to be out into the community and reach all these students. Not only do we have our services from the health department, but there are also colleges, trades, resources, mental health, things that the kids will need when they graduate. And students say they're grateful for the opportunity. It's been very helpful, especially to have like colleges here to like, get exposure to like the communities and what they feel like on campus. And also to just have people here to talk about health and wellness. It's really important, I think. I think it's just very interesting because like, I don't feel like we get enough information on those. And then, I mean, also like health and wellness, like there are people here in the health science pathway. So I think it's a great opportunity. Stephen Moody, Fox 10 News.